Hi everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to program a smart key into a Nissan. This is a Nissan Pathfinder 2016 model. At present we have one existing working key which will lock and unlock the vehicle. We have our new smart key which is not programmed so it does not do anything at this point. First thing you want to do is grab your OBD cable and plug it into the OBD port. In this car it is located central under the steering wheel. Once you've plugged that in, obviously just make sure you've got your lights on the VCI interface so you should have a light for power and a light for Bluetooth. You then want to grab your OBD star, agree to the disclaimer, click on Diag Program. Down the left hand side make sure you select Immobilizer. Scroll across until you find Nissan. Click on your latest version. You want to go for this vehicle to 20 digital pin code, smart key system, select from type, and you want to go for type 3. Click OK on program smart keys. It says close the ignition switch, so make sure the ignition is turned off, and open the emergency switch, so you want to turn on the hazard lights. Once you've done that, you can hit yes. It will then tell you all keys will be cleared. So you do need to make sure you have all existing keys, all keys that you wish to program back into the car. Hit yes. It then says press the start button. You'll get a flashing light. Hold the smart key for five seconds until the dash lights up. So press the start button. We're going to use the existing key. Hold it there. The dash then lights up at that point. You know you're OK to hit OK on the OBD star. It says program success, whether to program next one. So we're going to program our new one in. So we'll hit yes. Same thing, so you want to turn the ignition off first of all. Press it again so it flashes and hold your new smart key there. Wait for the dash to light up and hit OK. Again, it says program success, whether to program next one. We are finished, so we'll hit no. Same thing, press the start button to turn it off. Press it again so you get your flashing light and hold your smart key there until the dash lights up. Hit OK on the OBD star. You get a program success message. Again, hit OK. If you now turn the ignition off, the dash will give you a message saying key registration complete. At this point you are done, you can turn off your hazards, unplug the cable from the OBD port and test both remotes. So this is the existing remote, locks and unlocks the vehicle and the new one will lock and unlock the vehicle. Thanks.